everyone, my name is Mary. I'm a 19 year old in Uganda. I play football, I love football. It was the most beautiful game in the world and it always brings us together as a united team. Right now in Uganda, I'm working on a project to try and use football as a way of reaching out to the community to teach sanitation. Never you. Are you going One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. As you have seen in the videos, we play football, we enjoy it, but we celebrate by washing our hands in the football way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. It's no secret that the love for football runs deep in every youth. And we believe that through football, we can reach youth everywhere in this country and in Africa and tell them how to use the toilet well and not only to use it well but to also remember to look after and wash their hands well and to also reach out to their friends in the community and pass on the same message. Football changing everything. Good evening viewers, thank you for joining us today as we analyze the game between England and Germany straight from South Africa live at the GTC studios. I'm Mary Musimere and here with me in the studio today are two very good analysts. I'll let them introduce themselves. I'm Bobby Ray Margaret. I'm Gloria Wekembe. We see a very tight clash in the last 16 round today between Germany and England. Um, Margaret, briefly tell us about England. What should we expect? Predictions? Who do you think is going to be the man to watch today in the England squad? I think the man to watch in this game will be Jermaine Defoe. And I think England and Germany, it's going to be tough. I can't say England will win, but it's going to be a tough game. Okay, thank you Maggie. Jermaine Defoe is doing it for Maggie. And we shall be seeing that as the game goes on. Gloria, Germany is all yours. Anyway, German, the person to watch will be Lucas. That man is good and he's a midfielder. Join us as we take you to the games and we hope you will all meet your expectations as we see this tight clash. Thank you. Come on, try again. 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 Come
Look what good it is. Hello friends. Right now we're working with the girls and teaching them how to score using this football mechanism. We've already explained to them that once you score in the goal, you'll score right in the toilet. And if you don't score a goal, it's like you've scored, you, it's like you've gone to the toilet and you've done a mess all over the floor and people can't really use the toilet after that. So we're teaching them and with that background they're really enjoying themselves and learning that when they go to the toilet, they have to use the toilet right and only score in the hole in the toilet. Let's try it again. Time, I'm not losing. We're all going at the same time. Okay? One, two, three, Huh? I can make a shift. Eh? Between a poor and now. Huh? What is it? To play a cup. 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 To play a difficult it is to try and teach these children but it's moving progress and we believe as we continue to engage them in these activities teaching them football this way that they will learn and we'll have a generation of children that are clean and know how to use the, to the toilets right <laughs> Hello friends, you've seen everything that's going on here now. This is exactly what we're talking about. This is only one centre but there are so many more schools that we want to do this in. We want to teach good sanitation everywhere in our communities and we hope that we can transform all our communities and make our healthier country and a healthier nation for ourselves.